This is Devin from GameServers.com and I'm going to show you how to set up your Procon layer for your Battlefield 3 server. You're going to want to get the IP of your Battlefield 3 server as well as the port. Next find your Procon layer and click Config. You're going to want to put in the server IP of your Battlefield 3 server and the port number. You also want to put in the Archon password that is set on the Battlefield 3 server. If you do not know the password, go into your Battlefield 3 server config and look for the line admin.password and that will be your Archon password. Type that in this field and click add. Once that is updated, you will want to go to the Info tab and restart the server. Allow up to 30 seconds for the server to load. And while we're waiting for that to load, you'll want to open up your Procon client and click create connection now in my members area I can see that my Procon layer IP is 208.167.250.124 the port is 17070 the username will be admin and then enter your password which will be shown in your info tab once it has connected then click on the server from here you will go to parent layer control here you will see a list of plugins currently game servers only offers the three basic plugins that come with Procon however if you would like a plugin added please submit a support ticket I will show you how to set up in-game admin first you want to go to parent layer control and then click on accounts below you will see a username and password the username is case sensitive and must match the users in-game name in this case my in-game name is righty now if you would like to give them access to the Procon layer service you may do so I advise just giving them in-game admin. If you only want to give them in-game admin, you can give them any random password as they will not need it. Once the account is created, click on the account name. Go to edit account. Now, if you did choose to give the admin Procon layer privileges this is where you will give them permissions to now everything below commands accessible via remote console and plugins will be in-game admin in this case I'm giving this admin full permission Next, click Save Privileges. Go back to the Plugins tab and click on Basic In Game, I mean In Game Admin. In the bottom portion of your Procon client, you will see 
in-game admin enabled. If you need admin commands, click on in-game admin itself. And under details, it will show you the commands and what they do. Now after setting up all of this admin, in-game admin accounts, if for some reason the in-game admin is not working for one user, be sure to go back to accounts, make sure their account name is case sensitive, matching their exact in-game name, and make sure they also have permission set to have in-game admin.